Um, you know, first and foremost, I have to apologise to the fans. Um, you know, it was uh, an acceptable performance from ourselves. Um, you know, the first half, um, you know, wasn't good enough. I know that. Um, obviously, conceding before the, the half time, you know, you give yourself more to do. And then, obviously, concede the second. And then, you know, we, we get a goal. Create another good chance uh, for Razor on the post, but you know we wasted enough um, time in the game to, to react, and that's the most uh, disappointing factor. Of that. You say it's unacceptable. Was it? Did you not know what to expect, given how many times you've played Celtic and how many times you've played here? No, we know what to expect. Um, but as a team, we have to we have to show up on the day, and I felt that we didn't do that for large parts of the game, and you know we all have to look in the mirror and um, be honest with each other, and. Um, you know, there's obviously a lot to still play for this season. It's the first defeat we've had under the gaffer, um, but it's just a manner, obviously, getting uh, to get beat today. You never see the one to lose against your rivals and in a, and in a cup, cup, cup final. So, you know, we, we have to look at this and move forward. As a captain, then, what have you said to, you know, you're talking about looking in the mirror, what have you said to the rest of the team about being unacceptable and how you bounce back? I've had my words in there. I'm not going to go too much into detail, but we'll have, we've had a, an honest chat, and we'll have obviously an honest chat um, come through the week. Um, you know, emotions are running high, um, so we will have a chat uh, through the week. James, the team came into it in the second half. What was it in the first half? Do you think that didn't quite work? Um, I think a lot of things. Um, we obviously didn't get close enough. Um, we didn't really, you know, impact our football like we wanted to. So you know, it gives you. Um, a hill to climb. Mm. And you must have belief then when Alfredo brings you back into it? Yeah, we obviously get some belief then when you know Alfredo scored and then you create a couple more chances. Um, but you can't you can't give away that much time in a game to try and get yourself back in it. So um yeah disappointed with that. And do you think the team can still we obviously can still get the league and Scottish Cup to go, you think you can bounce back from this? Well like I said, it's the first defeat we've had under under the gaffer. Um, you know, we've been getting the results that we wanted to, but today when it matters, we, we didn't get the result. So we know there's a lot of work to be done and we're continuing to work hard at the training pitch, but, you know, we, we have to deliver when every game and, you know, we didn't do that today. And obviously, there's still a bit of a gap between yourself and Celtic in the league. Is the Scottish Cup even to more importance now? Um, well, Rangers Football Club, you know, we, we have to win every single game and that's the mentality um, but you have to you know you have to show up and we didn't do that today and you know we'll be going into Kilmarnock and trying to get the three points and trying to uh, win as many games as possible to the end of the season and see what it takes us it's obviously important um, you know it's, it's one of those where everyone in there knows we've let a lot of people down and that's the that's the one that hurts because you, you let so many people down um, in the manner that we didn't want to so um, you know come through the week we'll have, our, we'll have our chats and we'll be having our meetings so um, it's a bit hard to get your word across now because there's so much frustration um, obviously there's was some words but um, you know with a calm head through the week we'll, we'll go through a lot of things.